Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for tuning into today's video. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button down below, turn on the bell for notifications so you know when I upload next. And if you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thanks so much for being here today. So with this video, I just wanted to briefly just come on and encourage you all for the new year. We only have a short period of time left in 2016 and the fact that you've been able to see this year thus far and see it pretty much almost to the end is a blessing in and of itself. I know I'm very grateful and I'm very blessed to be here today. Um, this whole year has been just amazing. It's been good and it's been bad, but overall it's been good because I've been able to overcome the bad and be here today and be in a better space to be alive, to be able to encourage myself to pursue better, to do better, to be the best version of me. And I hope that you guys can look at it the same. I know many of us have gone through loss, have gone through pain, have gone through hurt, have gone through many things unthinkable or unimaginable. But I think in every bad situation, there is good. Um, I believe it's important to always be mindful of the way you think, your thought process, because thoughts become your reality and how you perceive things is how things will reflect and manifest in your reality so when you have a good mindset when you have a positive mindset despite the bad I think I think it's, I think you can bear a lot of things um, and I'm not saying to negate the bad and the hard times embrace those moments um, if you're sad be sad and be in that moment if you're angry be angry but don't let that take full control of your life don't let that overcome you but rather you have to overcome that. So with that being said, I think it's important to have a positive outlook on 2017, pursue things you never thought you would pursue, take a risk, take a chance on yourself. Don't hold back. If, if you wanna start YouTube, if you wanna start a blog, if you want to write a book, if you want to travel to every country in the world, every continent in the world, make that a plan for yourself, do it. Write things down. Make a plan and do it. Don't let anybody hold you back from pursuing something that you really wanted to do. There are people who might not understand why you're doing what you're doing. People might not, people might feel like, oh, what you're doing is stupid, or it's pointless, or what's the meaning of that? But at the end of the day, if you have peace within yourself and you've committed and you've committed your ways unto God, who who is man to say yes or no to you? At the end of the day, it's between you and God. A lot of times we tend to doubt ourselves, we tend to be fearful of the unknown. We fear what people might have to say. We even become our own worst critic and think, oh, this person is better at this than me or this person is this and that. But all of that doesn't matter. At the end of the day, we're all on our own journey in life, our own spiritual journey, our own journey to be great and accomplish great things. So don't allow what the next person is doing or what the next person has to say hinder you from fulfilling your fullest potential. Nobody knows the gifting and the blessings that you hold. Only you do, and only God does. And so sometimes you might have to move in silence and do things without telling people, and just allow people to see the manifestation of your greatness. Simple as that. And so I just wanna encourage you in 2017, speak things into existence. Don't hold back. Be grateful to be alive. Have a positive mindset. Go after whatever it is you're wanting to go after and pursue. Don't hold yourself back. Commit your ways unto the Lord and you're going to be fine. You can do it. I just know great things lie ahead for 2017. I just want to say happy holidays, happy new year, and God bless you all so much. Thank you guys and I'll see you guys next time.